Coach Miller, uh, C3 2017, you were at C3 2016 yep. in Waverly last year. Now you guys, uh, actually you guys got a great, you got a get out of that, didn't you? Yeah, uh, someone that we weren't really on um, early. And then, you know, you get, the, you get the binder and we weren't through. And there was a lot of things that he said on his profile that fit Loris. So we reached out and, you know, he came to visit campus and uh, met North kids. So it wasn't really too far. And now, now he's coming to Loris. So he'll be an incoming freshman. So... Yeah, you get one kid out of out of it, man. I think it's worth it. So I mean, come obviously, out here and check it out, and you know, you get to put Loris on the map for some of these kids that maybe maybe they were thinking Loris, and maybe they weren't, you know. And uh, you know, I always say, man, you can't hit home runs without taking swings. So you know, we like to come to these. There's a lot of good kids at this one. Independence, hell of a place to do it. So what a facility, yeah, right? Unbelievable. I've never, uh, especially for a two-way school. I mean, their room's probably bigger than ours. You know, it's just unbelievable to see what they did to this place, their weight room, and it's just top of the line. It's unbelievable. Where are you guys from here? Where's Loris from, from this location? Uh, just less than an hour. You go east straight on 20, run right into Dubuque, Iowa. Can't miss it. So, so you guys are close. right there by Dubuque and yeah. Mississippi River? Yep, right there, Illinois, Tri-State. So you can see, like, from Loris's campus, you can see the bridge that goes to Wisconsin, the bridge that goes to Illinois, all in the same spot. And you're in Iowa, so... It's That's a pretty, easy location. Pretty, yeah, pretty, it's a good location, oh, right? Yeah. Wisconsin. So, is it Quad Cities technically? Uh, Quad Cities is down uh, probably a little bit over an hour south of us. That's uh, like Moline and Davenport, Bettendorf, all those areas. Rock right Island. Down there. Yep. Okay. That's where so you guys are north of that. Okay. Yep. So looking at it though, when you come to this, you know, obviously you guys got a recruit out of it. You yep. have someone on the team now. Um, what do you think that that C three, you know, the, the the Compound College Combine does different than anything you've ever seen before? just gets kids from all over. I mean, I, there's kids from Colorado here, you know? I mean, where, where are you gonna be able to just go see those kids? I'm, I'm re and actually, I'm recruiting a kid from Colorado to, to begin with. So it's just good to like get out there and it's a good icebreaker to talk to those kids as well. Um, I just like it just because you get kids from all different areas of Iowa. You know, all, all, there's kids, a bunch of kids from Wisconsin and you get to get them in all one spot. And just, there's a lot that you can learn from watching kid go through practice, go through a long, long sessions, you know, so. And obviously, these kids want to want to wrestle at the next level. You know, there's really they're, they're coming here to get recruited, so it just makes it easy. Because a lot of times you're looking at you can look at brackets all day, and you know you can email a bunch of different coaches, but you never here you know these kids want to wrestle on at the next level. So it just it's a nice, easy way to get a good pool of recruits uh, to get to get going to start your year. What's it like going to a high, high school tournament? You wait around for a kid to wrestle two or three matches, they smash everybody, mm -hmm. and you really don't get much out of it. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, we know you can smash these guys. This tournament's not great. You know, what do you get out of this compared to that? Um, I mean, there's a lot of good kids in one spot, you know, so you kind of get to see them push. They put them through a lot of good situational stuff. Um, and, you know, just, just knowing the fact that, you know, it's a Sunday in August, school's right around the corner for most. Some, some have started, but some it's right around the corner. Maybe next week they're starting, and there's a lot of kids that would probably want to be doing something else with the last few weekends of their summer, and they're here wrestling. You know, so it just says a lot about th this is a passion, I think, for everybody that's in that room and all those kids. So it's just it's kids that you want to recruit. Um, and then a lot of them, you know, there's some sophomores and even juniors, so you kind of get, okay, these are the kids that are coming up. I'm going to keep my eye on their progression throughout the years before they get to like closer to their senior junior late later in their junior years when you start recruiting them so you know I just I just think it's just it's it's just a it's an awesome thing because you just get so many different people from different different areas of the state and nation in one spot.